Hello everyone and welcome back. It's Gina from OrchidandOpal.com and I have Sam's bead box in front of us for October 2021 that we're going to look through. Now I will leave the link for this subscription right down below the video and I also have a coupon code that will save you $5 off your very first box and that coupon code is ORCHID. O-R-C-H-I-D. I'll leave that down below as well. This is a subscription that comes out monthly that will ship to most of the world. And if you like check glass and also gemstone beads, this is one of those options that will be right up your alley because you're going to see a lot of different check glass shapes and some unique gemstone strands in a specific theme and color coordinated palette every month. And every month will be totally different. So let's open up this package and see what's inside. All right, so first of all, we have a little treat inside. So that is always a good start. And it looks like our theme is called Putting on the Glitz. And we're gonna be seeing some deep black sparkling crystal, captivating garnet tones, a family of owls, vitriol glass, and two gemstone strands that he had his cutter in India custom make just for the box. So we'll have a total of 16 check glass items, three gemstones, and two USA made tiara cast components inside to take a look at so i'm sure this is going to be beautiful and of course on our other page here we have the full list of everything that is going to be included so you know what you have plus sam has his very own bead shop samsbeadshop.com where you can purchase additional items he's got all sorts of check glass and gemstone items plus more on his site beyond the subscription so you can check that out but without further ado let's open up our bubble wrap And you can see we have a package full of all different items in here to take a look at. And I'm going to get organized so we can take a look at everything close up one at a time. All right, so as usual, it looks like Sam has put together a gorgeous box of items for us. And we're going to start out with some of our owls. We first have a bag containing two jet black and gold wash owls, 15 by 18 millimeter. There's two pieces inside. Aren't they adorable? And the hole runs up and down the length of the owl right there. You can make yourself a cute pair of earrings with those, absolutely. And to go along with those, we also have the Crystal AB Owls. You can see these are the same shape and cut, 15 by 18 millimeter. but they are in that totally different crystal clear that has that frosty matte look and that glowy AB finish. Then we have the Pear Brios. These are check glass as well. These are in jet black, 15 by 20 millimeter and four pieces inside the bag. I don't know what it is about this shape. I just love these check glass pear drops like this. And there's a look where the hole is, runs through the side at the top of that pointed section. And they're just so smooth and glossy and such a classic shape. Then we have a bag containing these sunburst coins in jet black. These are 14.5 millimeters in circumference and there's eight pieces included. I just love all the unique shapes that Sam includes month after month. You really get a great taste of all the different things that Check Glass has to offer in beads. So many different pressed glass shapes to play around with. And there's a look at the hole runs through the center of that flat disc shape with that pressed design that gives us that sunburst effect. We also have the check glass squares that are table cut in Jet Picasso. These are a 10 millimeter size. There's eight pieces included. You can see the jet black table cut flat and glossy. And then you have those indentions on either side with the circular design, the Picasso finish that settles in there to give us a little bit of interest and the hole that runs right through the center of the square. Next, we have a bag containing a strand, a very long strand actually, of faceted rounds. These are in black Picasso luster. They're a seven millimeter size and there's 29 pieces included. 
These have the most beautiful silvery glossy shimmer to them over the top of that jet black. Very beautiful addition to our theme and very glitzy and classic feeling as well. Our next bag contains some check pressed bicones in jet black. There's approximately 50 pieces included, so quite a few. These are about a six millimeter size. Here's a closer look at that handful of jet black, very uniform bicone beads with those smoothed out corners in that classic bicone shape. Lightening it up a bit, we have a bag containing some glass star rice beads. These are golden night, six by three millimeter and about 50 pieces included. Very generous handful here again, which we have come to expect from Sam's bead box. He includes quite a few of each of these different styles of beads, so you really get a lot to work with. These have that elongated oval-like rice shape with the hole that runs through the length. And then you can see that little bit of an etched star pattern on each facing of the bead with that gold wash that settles in. We also have a bag of lentil beads. These are in Crystal AB and they are the 8.5 millimeter size, about 25 pieces inside. Look at that AB coating giving us that rainbow effect over the top of that crystal clear glass that is just so reflective and beautiful. You have the hole that runs through the top of the lentil bead, so it's a little bit off center. And I've seen these used a lot in things like Kumi Himo. You can really use the fact that these are drilled off center to your advantage and get a lot of texture in your bead work. We have some more crystal AB in the form of these check glass long diamond beads, 24 by seven millimeter and eight pieces inside. These are a very substantial bead, a good long length. Part of the bead is just left crystal clear and then part has that AB reflective rainbow like coating over the top. The hole runs right through the length of the bead. And again, a generous amount of these to work with. And then next, these are absolutely stunning. I haven't even taken them out yet. These are the Czech Glass Faceted Rondelles in White Opal AB, five by seven millimeters, and there's 25 pieces inside. Oh my goodness, this strand is absolutely gorgeous. You have that almost stone-like gemstone quality appearance with that sort of milky opalescent white underneath that AB coating that gives us a hint of that metallic rainbow finish and also just a little bit of speckling that makes these look a little bit more stone-like. Next up, we have a bag with some vitriol finished check glass faceted ovals. There's about 25 pieces included. So these have a silvery, shiny metallic coating on one side, and then that inner area of glass is like a crystal clear with hints of pink and blue, some green showing up that are just very glowy and sparkly and bringing us some additional rainbow-like shine with that silver. We're bringing in some pops of red as well. We have this bag of marquee drops. These are 20 by eight millimeters and they are called red curtain. There's five pieces included. These have that dramatic deep red color with the hole up there that's drilled off center. And they are pretty thin, like a slice. And they remind me of like a little surfboard shape or something, but they really pop against that black and clear that we have going on. And then we have a bag containing some Czech glass rose coin beads. These are in Mars Red. They are a 14 millimeter size, and this is a strand containing about 10 pieces. I really like how these are variegated. That orangey red turns into a deeper, very dark maroon-like tone. And you can see these pressed glass beads have that additional detail that almost looks floral-like on either side. 
And then we have a bag containing the check glass faceted rondelles and garnet shimmer. And there's about 20 pieces inside. These are an eight and a half by six millimeter size. And these are absolutely very shimmery. Oh, wow. They've got a lot of that lustery coating over the top, giving us that hint of silver sparkle, but still letting a lot of that red from underneath show through. You can see the gentle faceting of these rondelle shaped beads and the hole that runs right there through the center. And then we have a bag containing 54 grams of the black and white check glass bead mix, which I will sort out for you at the end. It looks like there's a lot of gorgeous jet and also clear with AB finish. I'm seeing a little bit of matte. These mixes can be surprising. At first, it looks like a bunch of beads just jumbled up, which it is. But when you sort it out, you can see how many different shapes and sizes this really adds to the other contents that you can play with. And what's nice is we get a lot of larger quantities in some of these other bags, but these mixes offer you smaller quantities of a larger assortment of shapes. So we'll take a closer look at that one at the end. We're gonna bring in some of our Tierra cast here, that USA Pewter. We have two different things in here we're gonna look at. We have a three ring bar link and also branch link. And it looks like there's two of those three ring bars. Gotta love those Tierra cast components, and I always like to see those included with Sam's bead box, adding a little bit of something extra to the check glass and gemstone beads. And I've always been a fan of this shape. I think there's just so many possibilities with something like this. You have the three different openings, and you could use this in such a variety of ways as a connector in your jewelry making. It's the same on both sides. And then we also have that branch link with a loop on either end that you could use as something to attach your beadwork or your wire work or whatever it is you're doing. So those are definitely welcome additions. And now is where we're gonna get into our gemstones, those special gemstones he had cut for this box. First, we have the Indian Cut Garnet Center Drilled Marquee Dyed Beads. It's a seven inch strand of four by eight to five by 11 millimeter size beads. Aren't these absolutely stunning and so different? I love this cut. It's unlike anything that I have and I love that deep rich color. It's almost got a little bit of a pinky purple look to some of the beads. I'm gonna try to let some of that light show through so you can really see the different colors. I love how there's a variety of sizes, but all in that general shape that you see here, that marquee shape with the hole that's drilled through the shorter end at the center. And then next we have the Indian Cut Labradorite Irregular Hishi Beads. These are dyed four to five millimeters and a 10 inch strand. Gotta love the Labradorite. Look at those flashes of blue and a little bit of green that show up. Some violet shades against that gray background that is letting a little bit of light pass through there. You can see those beads and as I move them around, you can definitely see those flashes showing up, which we expect to see in the Labradorite. Just a gorgeous long strand of those beads in that he-she shape, which is that disc-like shape with the hole running through the center. And then our final bag contains the Black Onyx Smooth Round Beads. This is a seven and a half inch strand of eight millimeter size rounds. Look at that classic black onyx, just perfectly round beads that are a great way to wrap up this box of all different shapes, giving us a classic round shape to work with in a high quality stone. Such a great selection this month as usual and so different from all of his past months. I'm really excited about this combination. I think it's very classic. And I love to get boxes of colorful glass and gemstone beads balanced out with things like black and clear and sometimes earth tones. He's doing a great job at balancing all those different options. And right now I'm going to sort out this 54 gram bag of the bead mix and lay this out so you can really get a feel for the bigger picture of what's included. 
All right, so here is everything with the bead mix sorted out. And look at all these gorgeous leaves. Here's a close-up look at this shape and that jet black color. We have tons of those down there. We have some of these hematite like rectangles, some clear rectangles, some additional rounds, these teardrops that are clear with the AB finish, some more of the check glass bicones, these little leaves with a black wash, the matte frosty round beads here, and some additional ones scattered about that really add a lot to this selection. So a fabulous job once again, I think, by Sam and the team called Putting on the Glitz. Thank you for putting this box together for us and for giving me the opportunity to share this with everybody. I hope you all enjoyed it. Feel free to leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think of this month's package or anything else you'd like to say. Don't forget you can use the coupon code ORCHID, O-R-C-H-I-D, to save $5 off the first box if you'd like to try this one out. And again, I'll leave the link right down below as well as that coupon code so you can be taken directly to this subscription. Huge thank you to you all for unboxing this with me. I really enjoy having you here and I'm so appreciative that you joined me today. Please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already because I'd love to have you back and also feel free to hit that big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. I'll be back with much more. In the meantime, I hope you all have a fabulous rest of your day and as always, happy beating.